this your water? Do you have a water? I have a water in my car. Can I have a sip? This is hot. Thank you. Hi everyone, this is Amy with 100 Plus Abandoned Dogs of Everglades, Florida. Um, and shit show, I swear to God. I was out doing a home check for one of our dogs in a neighborhood close by. Thank you. And um, Carol's with me. Tiffany was here. She's on her way back. Um, while I was doing a home check, the neighbors were telling me that they hear constant barking from the backyard. I was able to view the backyard by standing on a chair and it's nothing but trash basically in the backyard. Mm -hmm. um, there was, she's on her way back, um, Who's on her way back? Tiff, uh, with a crate. Um, there was a barking in the backyard and um, there was definitely a crate back there and the neighbor said it's constant and it's it's 88 90 degrees almost 90 degrees it is so hot right now so I came to the next door neighbors and knocked on the door um, waited a few minutes and as I was standing on the doorstep uh, there are just there are cats everywhere there is a mama cat that is super sweet and she has three baby 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 kittens maybe a week old I'm not a cat expert but I do know that um, I can't walk away from these tiny kittens. Um, when I, I kept knocking on the door and finally a woman came to the door, she spoke, she speaks Creole. She doesn't speak English. I was able to communicate with the neighbor next door to here. Um, and uh, we got through to her basically explaining, and I also called animal control. So that was about a half an hour ago. They still have not arrived about the dog in the crate. But I was able to speak to her through the neighbor, explaining to her that the dog cannot be outside with the temperatures. It's illegal. Um, she's going to be sighted, and the dog will be taken to the kill shelter. She, she, she said she would bring the dog inside. Um, I wanted to see the dog. She brought the dog out on a leash. The dog is very well fed, fat, um, and uh, she promised she would keep the dog inside. With that being said, I do have the neighbors monitoring and watching that if they hear any barking, they'll call me immediately. At least I know for this moment that the dog is inside the house and not outside. The cap's loose. Uh, with this being said, I, I asked her, um, I'm gonna walk out, so I'm just gonna leave it running. There's cats everywhere. They're just all over the place. There's just trash everywhere. But it's okay, baby. Right here is mommy cat. Hi baby girl, you're so pretty. And there's three tiny, tiny babies. Um, they're very tiny, they're nursing. They can barely, their eyes are barely open. They could barely walk. They were just kind of stumbling all over. My fear is if they walk out in this street, they're gonna be smashed. They're gonna be killed immediately and they're not gonna stand a chance. Uh, so I'm not going to leave uh, this mommy cat and her babies. I have no place, I don't know where to take them. Um, the only place I have is a vet's office. I'm desperately, desperately, desperately seeking help, whether it's a foster, um, a cat rescue that can help me out. There's just cats roaming everywhere here. Um, but I do know that this mommy cat and her babies can't stay here. They just cannot stay here because um, they will not stand a chance. They are nursing right now. Hi guys, can you see me? Am I clear? Thank you, Dee. Yeah, I'm talking about a situation. Um, again, I'm going to recap really quickly. Um, I'm not a cat rescue. Every life matters. We have rescued hundreds of cats, but we've always had a place, a foster, um, and, and a place to take them. I don't have any place to take them, and I, I'm not going to leave these babies here. I will not leave them here to end up dead and smashed as roadkill on the street. So uh, Tiffany is on her way back with a crate. Um, again, the reason I'm even here is is because I was doing a home check. Do you hear a dog barking? Yeah. That's inside the house? Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah, they have two dogs now. They have, according to what she told me, there's two dogs. Um, but I'm waiting on Tiffany to bring me a crate 
so I can get the mama cat and the babies out of here safely because in two seconds I mean they were just like wobbling and falling over on the stoop if they walk out to the street they're gonna be dead in a second and it's so hot brutally 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 hot and these are tiny 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 little babies there's so many cats everywhere but this I just can't walk away from these little babies um, again the reason that I am here to begin with is I was doing a home check I met Tiffany for a dog uh, one of our dogs it didn't work out because they have a cat and we weren't comfortable um, but anyway um, when I was at the home check they were telling me that their neighbor the barking is non-stop um, and I was looking over the fence there's nothing but garbage um, just debris garbage just I could barely see the yard and I saw a crate and I heard barking non-stop so I decided to knock on the door uh, waited and that's when I saw the mama cat and the kitten kittens um, finally when she came out uh, she said she did not speak any English I was even trying to use the um, the app to convert uh, English into Creole to communicate with her. I've already called animal control because I didn't know how this was going to play out. Um, I'm in Fort Lauderdale, Brenda. Um, so anyways, I got the neighbor to communicate to the owner, um, to her. I'm taking the cat and the kittens. I can't leave them here. I, they're so young. They're going to die. I, I don't know where I'm going to do with them, but I can't leave them here. Did you see them? No, he told me about it. Look at that. I mean, look. They're little beep. It's fine. I got her to come out and show me the dog oh, okay. out of the crate, and mm -hmm. I told her right. she cannot. Yeah, I have to pull out real quick. Okay. Yeah, she okay. Three tiny little babies nursing. Oh, they're not yeah. going to make it. When they got up to walk, they were stumbling. If they go in the street, they're going to be roadkill. Oh, jeez. So. Yeah. Anyways, I made her take the dog inside. Oh, okay. Well, that's good. So just, we, I need, you know, watch. Yeah, we will. If you hear anything, call me immediately. Oh, okay? Like I said, if you know of any other dogs that might be... Of yeah. course. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Thank you so Thank much. You. Oh, that's the neighbor that uh, is monitoring for us. Um, they wanted our dog Nelson, but we're not comfortable with Nelson with their cat. They have a handicapped cat that can't get away, if God forbid, and we're just not comfortable. So they're looking for a dog. Um, so this is how it all can I bring to Hollywood, Dana said. Yeah. Of course. Of course. All right. Hollywood where? Okay. I'll, I'll reach out to her. Um, I'm trying to network to get these this mama and these babies safe. Um, so that's what I'm working on right now. I'm waiting on Tiffany to get um, here with a crate so that I can get them safe. And that's where we are. She can take mine now. Yeah. Put Tiffany. Is that her? Hold on, guys. Put him in your car? No, in Tiffany's. Do you have a blanket or do you need, yeah? They can't get out of there, can they? No. no. The kittens are tiny. Is that shit, right? Oh no, it's stick. Yeah, I definitely can't leave them here. They'll end up dead. There's no way. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. We'll just bring it really, really close because I don't want Mommy to run if we try to grab her. You gotta grab Mommy first. Mommy's first. 
Do you need gloves or are you just going to pick her up? Okay. She, she seems, seems very, very sweet. sweet. She does not seem feral at all. Yeah, but putting her in a cage might be a I know. Hi, Mama. Just have to grab her by the scruff. I've got the door tip if you want to go around this way and I'll close it when you bring it. She's going to be scared. She's already getting scared. It's okay. It's okay, Mommy. That's okay, Mommy. Baby, you can Is she? Yeah. Do you want a glove? Get a glove. Do you want a glove, Tiffany? Yeah. How about a blanket? Do you have another blanket? In the back of my hatch is gloves, and there's a sweater if you want to grab my sweater. She's petting her. There's little gloves in a uh, brown, um, they were just delivered. It's a package. There's little gloves. I wonder if we put one of her kittens in here if she would go in here. Kittens are easy. Grab Grab me one of the Hold on. Oh, wait, 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 no, back up, back up. I don't want to freak her out. Put her right in. Okay, close the gate. Okay, you're a, oh, okay. a baby. Yeah, yeah she's, she's a baby. She's freaking out. Okay. 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 It's okay, Mommy. We're going to get your babies. Your it's okay. <gasps> oh, she's freaking. Okay. It's okay, Mommy. Here's your baby. Here's your baby. If you open, she's going to run. She's trying to get out. Uh, she's going to try to get out. There you go. Okay. Okay, perfect. There you go. Perfect. Perfect. Mission accomplished. I've been watching and there's only been three. I mean, I, that's all I've seen nursing on her. And I've been here for an hour. I know. You're okay. You're safe, babies. That's it, boo-boos. You're safe now. It is so brutally hot. These babies, when they were, they could barely walk, and they would have right. ended up dead. Oh, she's a baby. She's a baby herself, and she's, she's so. Probably not even a year. Anymore. No, she's not. All right. Who, um, are, are they going to Hollywood? Dana said she'll take them in Hollywood. You want to bring them? Where? I'll text you the address. I guess I could. What are you doing? What time is it? I'll take a ride with you. Let's drop off my car at the rescue house and I'll All right. Drive. Well, Carol and I will bring him. Just put him in my car. All right, guys. We're out. We're going to go take him to our friend Dana. Thank you, everybody. Please make a donation. Any amount that we raise will go towards Dana. She's a friend of ours that does cat rescue. Um, we will make a donation towards her, her organization. She's freaking out. No, right in the back seat. Right in the back seat, it's fine. Okay, you're okay. Oh, jeez. She's probably never been in a cage before. Huh? 
I'll meet you at the rescue house. Yeah, and then we'll just go. All right. Guys, please make a donation. Mommy and three baby, baby, baby kittens that are just completely terrified. We could not leave them. Um, there's not an injured cat. Here's animal control. Let's see what, I, I got the AC running. Let's just let them chill in here. Let me talk to animal control. Yeah, I just wanted to cover her. Perfect. To calm her down. Yeah, I'm gonna leave the AC running. Crank it up. Yeah, I've got my keys. You can close that. Um, where's my mask? We need a mask. Can't, oh. can't be out here without a mask. Hold on, guys, please. Never a dull moment, is there? Didn't plan this for, did not plan this. Literally, good thing I came here to meet you, Tiff. Hi there. I was the one that called you. How are you? I want to tell you what's happened, transpired since I called you. Um, one of the neighbors called us. We were here doing a, a home check for potential adoption with our rescue. And they said, 24-7, there's barking in the back and it's a cage. So I decided to knock on the door and see if I could reach her before bothering you. Um, and I, she only spoke Creole, okay. but I was able to communicate with the neighbor okay. to make her understand, you can't leave an animal in a crate. I okay. said, I need to see the dog. She brought me the dog out on a leash, looked very well, not skinny. And she said she understood the dog will be inside. There's okay. another dog inside. They're gonna watch, the neighbors are gonna watch. And if they hear anything, then we, whatever. Okay. While I was here though, and I'm not a cat rescue, but there was a mommy cat with three tiny, tiny, tiny babies that they're wobbling. If they walk, they're gonna be dead. And there's cats all over. I know the cat season. Um, so I'm taking the cat and the kittens okay. to a rescue. Okay. So they're safe. Okay. So thank you for coming. Okay. For now it's good. Okay. Um, I would, just okay. so she understands that she can't put a dog in a crate. Okay. It's against the law. Okay. And that, you know, what the repercussions so, will be. So instead of knocking and having that... I would, I would have a police officer. Uh, well, we have a Creole speaking officer. Even better. So, okay. Thank you Thank so you. much for coming. Okay. Sorry. Okay, All right, sounds good. And there you have it. I know. There's such baby baby. That one's eyes just opened. Because one of them looks Hi. half closed still. You're such a baby. One, two, three. One's trying to nurse. Mm -hmm. it's okay, and then there's mommy. the two. You're okay. You going to find mama? Hi, mommy. Mommy's a baby. Such a baby. It's okay. You're safe, baby girl. I'll cover this for you. Okay? I'll see you there. Bye, Jeff. Bye. Thank you. All right, guys. There you have it. Because every life matters. Mommy and three babies took care of the dog. She's going to follow up the animal control officer to make sure that she understands you cannot put a dog outside in a cage. It is 90 degrees. It is so brutally hot. We are on our way to get these babies safe to Hollywood to our make a donation. I'm asking everybody, please.